Hey guys, I'm Zerfall, and welcome back to Let's Play Lifeline. We're in the laboratory, and you know what? I think if we look at our special scenario, there's not much going on yet. Okay, so. Um, consultation. I'm just okay. curious. A consultation. What would you like to consult me about? Where is Naomi? Yeah, we can't do anything yet. All done. Sexy pose. Thanks. Finished. All right. Consultation is over. <laughs> She's kind of creepy fooling this guy. Sexy pose. We don't have time to be fooling around here. Ah, oh, yes we do. Ah, oh, jeez. All right, what do we got? We're closest to... Experiment Rack 3. Experiment Rack 3, okay. These look like test systems. Everything around this pillar seems to be. Oh, we got stuff to... Examine arm. Are you talking about that? I am. Look at robot arm. Were they using this for animal testing? Standard engineered manipulator constructed with 12 joints to provide greater flexibility and range of motion than the human hand. It's the Canada arm. Check panel. What should I check? Look at buttons. What should I check? Look at control panel. It's the panel for controlling the robotic arm. Yeah, yeah. At least that's what I think. Let's but use I'm not it. Really sure. Summary emergency mode is inoperable. Okay. Look at... Con well, we already know. Leave. It's a panel for controlling an experiment rack. Probably. Experiment rack 1. Experiment rack 1. Okay. And from there we'll go to storage, then rack 2, then sample cases. No, this is the exact same thing. Look at control panel. It's a panel for controlling an experiment right. rack. Probably. Look at robot arm. Is it a tool for experiments? Oh, I that don't one's really gonna know. probe. Storage booths. The storage booths. Okay. Ooh, sick tricks. Wow, you turned around for no reason. Okay. Well, there's a lot of stuff here. Look at booth. It's a big lever. Sure I don't have the faintest idea what it's used for, though. Okay, lock lever. A safety device used during the storage and extraction of experimental rack. Lower the level after completing all other procedures. Okay, so don't do that first. Look at storage booth. I guess it's like a storage closet for machines. Okay. Um, look at storage rack. Even heavy equipment has to be kept in something like this or it will float away. Check open storage rack. This storage rack? You're joking. It's not anything I can open by hand. Uh, I said look. Look at storage rack. Inside? Yeah, there's nothing. Look at second storage rack. Look at second from right storage rack. It was empty inside. Look at left storage rack. Inside? Yeah, there's nothing. Look at second to left and second to right storage rack. Look at second to left storage rack. Look at the storage rack second to the left. Inside? It's empty. Look at storage rack third to the left. Inside? There are only machines stored in here. Only machines. Okay, so that's all empty. Um... Hmm, what's this last thing? Look at button? What should I check? Uh, look at... What should I check? What would that thing be? Check panel? What should I check? Pull lever? Do what with what? Use the lever. I think it would be better if we didn't move things indiscriminately. We don't have any idea what sort of equipment they have in a lab. It's too dangerous. 
Okay, okay. Um... What is that other thing? Look at handles. The sample cases. Okay. You know what? Fine, whatever. Check top. Are you talking about that? Sure. Check top sample case. This... It's one of those monsters. Yeah, it is. I knew it. Oh, gosh. We're going to have a low battle. This is battle. evidence of illegal experimentation. Check middle sample case. Inside? Nothing. It's empty. The darkest gift. Check bottom sample case. There's another one here. It's alive. There's another one here. Okay, so that's all that. Go to experiment rack two. Experiment rack two, okay? Did we already go to two or did we go to one? I meant to go to one. Oh, there's something floating up there. Okay, there's a robot arm. Look at shoe. Okay, I'll leave. No, go. Go to experiment rack two. Experiment rack two, okay? Look up. Up? Huh? What is that? It's a shoe. Naomi shoe. What is this shoe? Hey, can you analyze this for me? What? It is Naomi shoe. Was Naomi here? We had to register every item that we wore. Huh? There's something like a tunnel in the back. Could she be beyond there? I can't Maybe. get in there unless the gap is widened. This device. It's an auto emergency mode. It can't be directly operated. Hmm. We need to find another way of lowering this device. Maybe that's what the big lever's for. Uh, go to storage device. The storage booths. Okay. Uh, pull lever. It's a big lever. I don't have the faintest idea what it's used for, though. Yeah, all right, all right. Uh, control panel? Ah, uh, there we go. Experiment rack ah. jettison. That's it! If we get rid of the experiment rack, I'll be able to enter that corridor. Perfect. Yeah, it's okay. This system appears to operate even in an emergency. Okay, let's give it a shot. Try operating the machine. Alright, uh... There's a message panel. The disengagement code numbers will be displayed in sequence. Please communicate the code numbers to the operator. Okay, so if we just got to read the codes code to code is not entered before it disappears from the screen, please repeat the process from the beginning. Ugh. They're just extending oh, gameplay. I get it. I read some numbers, and you enter them. Oh, that's, that's even easier. Easy. We'll okay. get it done in a jiffy. Now entering relief code. I thought I had to tell her the numbers. Let's see. Nine, five, and one. That's it. Quit dawdling. Hurry, enter the code. Five. It's four, going to reset it. Release code acknowledged. Please okay. proceed. Let's see. Three, eight, uh, seven, and five, and one. Yeah, that's how people five, talk normally. Three, eight, and seven, and one. Please proceed. Let's see. Uh, Naomi. Two, not Naomi, seven, real. eight, star, and nine. Five. Release code acknowledged. Please proceed. 
Let's see. Two five star up, four five star and six one. Five. It's four, going to reset its three. Site. Relief code acknowledged. Please proceed. Let's see. Three four six uh five eight star four two. Five. We had no pound signs. Let's see. How many are there? Star, star, pound, star, pound, pound, and star, star. Incorrect oh. relief code. Please try again. I shouldn't have complained about the pounds. <sighs> you blew it. We have to start all over again. Get Maybe together. if you said the code a little slower. Uh. Let's see. Two, zero, and one. Relief code acknowledged. Please proceed. We can do it. Let's see. You can do it nine times. Twenty-seven and six. Five. Pound, pound. Oh, no. Just one pound. Five. It's going to... Relief code acknowledged. Ugh. Please proceed. Pound, pound. Let's see. Six, four, and seven. Seven pound. Relief code acknowledged. Please proceed. Who throws in? Let's see. Double numbers and regular star, numbers. Star, star, pound, star, pound, pound, and star, star. Relief code acknowledged. Yeah. Please I think that's proceed. the hardest one. Let's see. Two five star up, four five star, and six one. Five. Relief code acknowledged. Please proceed. Oh, more still. Let's see. One zero zero and one pound star and two two. All relief codes acknowledged. Yeah. It seems to have worked. Please. Hang on for a second. All right, let's see what happens here. <sighs> Now ejecting experiment rack. All personnel must maintain a safe distance. It's been launched into space. We did it. Maybe Naomi will be in there. Let's. Don't you think the two go. of us are becoming a great team? Maybe we don't even need to find Naomi anymore with how great of a team we are. Can we consultation yet? Oh, there's a brain in a jar. I, I better not be now. I feel you. That doesn't Who? sound like a Naomi. Who's there? Alan. Could it be Joe? Is this her dad's alive? brain? I think I can communicate with it using this keyboard. Please. Isn't this enough? Turn off the machine, let me die. Oh my god. This game is getting real dark. Hmm. You. You're not a researcher. Please. For years, wicked scientists have experimented on me with that stone. Over and over. And now this is what I have become. Turn off the machine, I beg you. You. What do you want? Who are you? No. Don't worry. I'm just a waitress. Ah. Someone from JSL. I sensed some sort of crisis in the hotel. stone on this station? Yes. I see. I was a fool. I thought that the stone would bring happiness to the world, the way it had done for our family. It is her dad. Too much corruption in the world. 
television, politicians, the people on the streets, everywhere. The evils of jealousy and greed have corrupted our planet. Damn television. This is the world that they would produce more of the stones for. I beg you, turn off this machine. All right. Thank sure you. <laughs> There is one last thing I wish you could do. Yes. In Japan, there is a woman named Ryo Honheim. I want you to find her and tell her her mother still lives. <gasps> tell her to find her mother. Oh my god. There's an account in her name at the Swiss Union Bank. Enough money there so she can have a good life. Will you do this for me? What is wrong? Please. I beg you to do this. I won't fail. She already Thank knows. You. You're very kind. Farewell. Oh. Please, God. Please, release him from his pain. Trolls organism substance systems. It's absolutely forbid to turn off the device, whatever the situation may be. Sign. Hurry, do it. Oh man. It's a real heavy game now. Tate yet? The station's falling to Earth. What should we do? The hatch is open. Okay, I'll come get you right now. We'll have to split up and find Naomi somehow. I think I know where Naomi is. Uh, I think we found Naomi. You, you're please. What is he? Are you okay? What's wrong? I'm sorry. Oh no, please. Naomi! Naomi! She almost turned human for a second. This is too bad because we didn't get a chance to do some consultations asking where my Naomi was or about Alan's research and stuff. So. Operator? 
Oh, jeez. Am I... Am I cursed? They all died. In the end, I couldn't save anyone. Could everything... Could it all be because of me? No. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry to have gotten you and everyone else involved in this horrible mess. There's no way for me to repair the damage I've caused. But Naomi asked me to save you. Whatever happens, I will save you. Will you wait for me? Yes. Thank you, Operator. It's really too bad the save points are so far apart now. I don't can't, know if you uh, realize this. Maybe you already know. This. These monsters. Some are actually people who've mutated. But not Naomi. <laughs> she lived and died a beautiful woman. How touching. Joe oh, Coward. jeez. Hold it. You're How is there gravity all of a sudden? Later. Oh, there's not. He's floating. He just floats like a man standing. Would you like to know what you've done? <laughs> you and the operator. You killed the girl that your operator was searching for. <laughs> How ironic that you doomed the one person you were trying to save. You turned her into a monster. Didn't you? I've been in the lab watching everything you've been doing. Just as you guessed. The story about the UFO is a lie. <laughs> the so-called aliens are nothing more than mutated animals created by the stone and accursed words. What great lip sync in here. Why stop there? Testing on animals wasn't enough to satisfy a person such as myself. Always in search of knowledge, I had to know exactly what effect the stone would have on a human being. <laughs> Does he know how insane he sounds? You used her for some twisted experiment? Absolutely. Monstrous as she appeared, she never meant to harm anyone, yet you killed her. All she was doing was asking for her boyfriend. You psycho. She didn't mean to kill anyone! She was totally unaware of the threat she posed to those around her. Oh yes, her boyfriend. He's been your operator, correct? He's been poisoned by the toxin from a mutated caterpillar. He'll surely die. I'm the one who locked him in the monitor room. <laughs> what a dick! You're a heartless bastard! Well, it's too late to save him. Of course, being on this station, it won't make a difference. <laughs> so it was you who altered the station's orbit? That's correct, Rio Hohenheim. I still find it puzzling. I'm an accomplished marksman, and I was certain I'd shot you in the heart that time. But I won't fail twice. Can I analyze this disc now, finally? of such a brilliant man. I'm amazed at how stupid you are. Joseph Kraft, my German birth name, translates to Joe Powers in English. Well, <laughs> I'd better be off with the Philosopher's Stone. <laughs> oh. I think you got him. She's Iron Man! 
crap. You're lying. That's not the Philosopher's Stone. And, by the way, you didn't miss. Many years ago, you shot me through the heart. And I really did die. My father took the stone, pressed it into my wound, it revived me. And I escaped. It's been keeping me alive ever since. This guy's already dead, he can't hear you. What you have there is only good for creating monsters. It's a fake! Look, about Naomi, I'm so sorry. You saw it? There was nothing I could do. I swear it. I will not let you die, I promise. Oh, what? I'm calling it now. Stone. She has to give the stone to us to keep, keep us alive. alive. And get you to a hospital. Alright, what do we got? We got hatches. Consultation. Okay, a consultation. What would you like to consult me about? Alright, what do we got here? You are strong! I'm the daughter of that father. So don't you think it's only natural that I'd be tough? Sure. It's about Naomi. I don't know if this will be of any use to you, but... There are monsters in human guise. Naomi was never a monster. I think she lived and died a wonderful person. What is a fake stone? What is a fake stone? Yes, that stone is an artificially made fake. The real one, I have with me always. Is it just me or is every once in a while her eyes look like they get like super wide? It's creepy. Powers is Joseph? Well, something bothered me about his whole attitude. But I'm glad he appeared. I finally got to avenge my father. Alright, what do we got? Do we have a save point? No. Hatch four? Hatch four. Alright. Consultation is over. Oh right, we have to leave the consultation first. Hatch four. Hatch four, okay. Seems to be open. The hatch is already open. Hatch Let's six. Let's go search somewhere else. Hatch six. Hatch six, okay. Oh shoot, I should have gone back to see my game. Uh, hatch three. Hatch three. Stop. I can't talk. Oh no. Hatch three? Hatch three. Okay. Run. Quickly. Okay. Oh gosh, she can't go quickly. Go faster. Oh. In space, no one can hear you sigh. Oh well, I, I mean, I guess it's close enough to half an hour, we should save the game and then call it a video. There we go, there's a save point in here, right? Oh, I wonder if we can consultation in here still. Consultation! Okay, a consultation. What would you like to consult me about? Let's see if we can ask some of these old ones. Uh, like... Uh, the monsters were made here? Alan was construct conducting research here. Where is Naomi? Exit. Done. All right. Consultation is over. Oh well, this consultation's over. Sexy pose. We don't have time to be fooling around here. <laughs> save point. The save point. Okay. All right, so. Naomi's dead. The main bad guy's dead. Rio's on her way to us uh, to save us from poison. Uh, hopefully that all goes well. I'm Zerfall. Thanks for watching. And I hope to catch you in the next video where we finally reunite. Or unite for the first time? Oh no, we met her when we, she was a waitress. Reunite with Rio. See you then.